What's up, everyone? David here. Laurel. Today we have the BAM box, and it's the October uh, BAM box, which was themed watching. That's what it was. Uh, theme was watching, and they guaranteed three autographed items. That's pretty cool, because usually they have two autographed items, or I think maybe like one autographed item with an option of two. I don't know, either way, there's three in this box. We're excited. So, open it up. And everything falls out. There's the, oh, the pen. The pen, we're excited. What? Wait, it's Why am I excited? little Sam. What? Yeah. Oh my god, that is the coolest pen. Because it's, it. it's uh, Sam from Trick or Treat, which... By the way, it's one of our favorite films. We watch this every Halloween, mm -hmm. and I think we're going to be watching it on Halloween mm -hmm. this Usually year. Usually on Halloween is when we watch it. Great movie. Uh, that is by far mm -hmm. one of the coolest, coolest, coolest items, pen-wise, that we've gotten. Or just even in general. Mm -hmm. uh, just a little book. Oh, uh, spoiler booklet. <laughs> All right. Get that out of here. So, alright. Maybe that, and take the wrapper out. That's all you're gonna see. And I'm letting Mara bring things out this time. You can put it on the bed or whatever. What is it? it says BAM exclusive. Demonic box puzzle cube. Not. Let's see what it actually looks like. I can't do it. Good job. You ripped the package. Sorry. All right. Well. Oh, so it's a Rubik's uh, Rubik's cube, and demonic box. Doesn't say. Now, okay, I haven't seen Hellraiser, but I know. I believe there was a box in the movie that had scriptures on it so maybe um, I'm looking at my phone because I can't tell what is glaring or not using the new GoPro Hero 5 so that's why I keep looking to my left but I'm guessing that's from Hellraiser it doesn't say it just says demonic box but we'll see in the spoiler book but really cool item Rubik's Cube, Demonic Box. This one is an S Smart name tag. Hello, my name is Ash Warehouses. I'm not sure where that's from. Well, I, I from. know Ash is from, like, Ash and the Evil Dead or uh, just the Evil Dead franchise, but I don't know if that's going to be from the same. We haven't fully caught up on our Evil Dead. Yeah, We've only can... seen like a couple of them. Yeah, so cool I don't know. But again, the spoiler book will probably let us know, but it is a BAM exclusive. Oh, so here's the kiss item. There's it's a comic book. You're gonna have to oh. There you go. You always do it the other way. First issue by Dynamite Comics. Signed. Oh it's signed too? Right here. Oh, yeah. So I don't know who it's signed by, and let me see if I can... Signature's up here just above the word BAM. Don't know how well you can see it, but... Maybe it's by one of the authors? That's the author or illustrator? That's one of my main guesses, because... But that's really cool. I'm excited for the... What? This is a cool print. So it's got its certificate of authenticity and it's signed. That's really cool. I love Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Hell, I'm right. I'm wearing one of the shirts from the Horror Block, uh, from Nerd Blocks Horror Block. So, huge fan. 
And then you got Michael's My Michael's Meyer. Michael Myers from Halloween, which is really cool. I really like this art print. Also signed. Yeah, yeah. Down there too. It's got two women down in the knives. I don't know how well you can see that. Uh, but it's signed, and it's number one, 1,759 of 2,500. That's a really cool item. I really like that. So that's two of the three signed items. Here's the... Th what? Oh my gosh. That's that is really game. cool. Exorcist. Great movie. Terrified the crap out of me when I was younger, but... Such a good movie. And plus, I grew up miles away from the original house that this movie was based on the real exorcist um, no one really knows his real name but it was a boy that it really happened to instead of but in the movie they made it a girl it looks like it's signed by um, uh, Linda Blair is that her name? Linda Blair it, it, yeah that looks like uh, I mean that's L. what it looks like yeah like maybe it L. would make sense for her to sign it I mean it'll probably say mm -hmm. it in the thing but if that is Signed by her, that is extremely awesome. Was that that's everything it. that's in there? That's it. Alright. This box is pretty cool. Oh. Let's see. Let's see if my guesses were right. So we have Oh, we didn't get any of the one up keys, did mm -mm. we? Nope. Twice now we haven't gotten any. It's okay though. It's cool. It's cool. Not everyone's gonna win something. So for the pins, you were able to get Jigsaw from Saw, Chucky, or Trick or Treat, or Sam from Trick or Treat. Uh, if you had the green one up, you would have gotten an exclusive Jigsaw pen. Don't know how well you can see any of this with all the lights, but out of all these pins, Sam is definitely our favorite one. Mm -hmm. That is really cool. Oh, and I was right. The demonic box from Hellraiser is the Rubik's Cube. Never seen the movies, <laughs> but I knew there was a box in it. The scriptures on it. I know. So, okay, okay and right is it again. From the show? I'm sure it's from the movie? show. Probably. Because the third movie, he, well, I don't know. So the picture, you guys would probably know this better. Picture shows Ash from the third movie, Army of Darkness, in the back. Uh, but it's got his picture uh, with his name tag. Again, maybe it's from the show. Maybe it's from the movie. We haven't seen the third movie. Yeah. And we haven't seen the show, but we've seen the first two movies, and we love the franchise. We've even seen the remake. I enjoyed it. Pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah. Uh, it shows the next month's theme is adult cartoon. So, you know, it's got Simpsons, Mick, Rick and Morty, not Mick, Bob's Burgers, Beavis and Butthead, and it shows Buddy Boot down here. That's cool. Uh, so, okay, yes, it is signed by Linda Blair herself. That is awesome. That is is freaking awesome. You could have gotten one of two pictures of her. Hopefully you guys can see. It was pretty well. The other option. The other options her standing up. No, I'm saying like oh. you could get a signed thing of her. Oh. Or yes, yeah, so uh, you could either face. get one of two yeah. A signed thing from Linda Blair or Ghostface, signed by Skeet Ehrlich, or Ur Ehrlich, or something. You can see Ghostface down here. Ah, uh, I love Scream. I just actually started watching the Scream TV series, and I fell in love with it. Um, I'm, I would have been fine with either or. They're both really cool. I love both of them, but. 
this is extremely awesome. I uh, could have gotten the Wait, comics. Is it signed? Oh, yeah. Signed by cover artist. Yeah, signed by cover artist. So, the Kiss comic was signed by the cover artist, John Lucas. So that's who that was signed by. And you could have gotten one of two. If you had the yellow one up, you would have gotten the one without color. So just the black and white version. And, ooh, that's awesome. So the signed one with Michael Myers and Leatherface could have either gotten that one or one with Freddy and Jason. That's awesome. Who is it signed by? Artist John Branham? Branham, Branham yeah. Sorry, I'm getting text messages. So, I, again, I would have been fine with either or. I love all classic horror movies. This one's really awesome. So this definitely did. That's gift to band box. All right. That's all of that. Band box is probably one of the hardest boxes to put prices on items because they go beyond expectations and like go and get autographs from these people they gotta set up the meetings meet up with them that person's gotta sign you know hundreds maybe even thousands I don't know how many boxes they ship out every month but band box is always the way to go it's you just never know what you gotta get mm -hmm. and it's always really cool stuff definitely probably one of my favorite I've, we've only gotten, what, two band boxes now? Mm -hmm. I don't even remember what we got in the first band box. Oh, yeah, it had, like, uh... Was it, like, the Willy Wonka? Yeah, well, it was Gene Wilder's, uh, like, a homage to Gene Wilder. All right, that's going to be the end of this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. <laughs> Hopefully you guys even got your own band box. If you didn't, get the, ne get the next month's box. I can't talk today. <laughs> this is ridiculous. All right. Peace out. Bye.